Sama dudes. Same Sam under here. Uh, not gonna lie, I have been spoiled a little bit about this. Not everything, though, thankfully. Um, I know to choose your Legends winners, unfortunately. Um, and I, I, I saw the new uh, special login, uh, the little banner. Uh, but I don't know too much else. So this is like 20 minutes, so I'm hoping that there's some stuff that hasn't been spoiled for me. Um, I'm mainly hoping for a new unit type and some unit demotes. It's really all I want. If we get that, I'll be content, honestly. Uh, maybe some fade pass changes, but honestly, weapon de like hit five star demotes and new weapon type is all I really need. Um, so let's see what they're gonna talk about. I can see, I think that's the Valentine's banner, like I presume on the very right. <sighs> Alright. So, I'm not salty about it. I'm just sat. Uh, 72,000! Okay. So, Jesus Christ. The main thing I'm sad about is that, like, you know, I'll explain after the video. I'll explain about at the, at the end of the video. But I'm not too mad. But I'm kind of a, I'm kind of sad about it. Um, but I was okay. I'm I'm okay with him getting a brave ult. Don't get me wrong. It's uh, it's something else, which I'll explain later. Okay, yeah, special hero someone I've seen. Uh, fourth anniversary hero I haven't seen. Grand hero battle of soul. Login bonus I've seen. Oh wait, no, I don't know. I don't think I noticed two login bonuses. Oh, okay. I didn't notice a trait fruit one. That's cool. I actually just didn't notice that. I just passed on. Oh, I just passed over it. So I'm glad about that. That's nice. Um, okay, yes, I can talk about it now instead of at the end because I just talk about Ether raids and stuff. Um, so I didn't want another Brave Veronica to happen. Where, like, um, we, you know, we get Brave Veronica, and then we still, to this day, have not got a regular Veronica. And I don't want that to happen with uh, Gatekeeper. I would rather him win, uh, like, come third this year, um, get a, be the Grand Hero Battle, and then win next year. That was my main hope. Um, then, um, like, and I feel bad for Marth as well. Like, you know, we've had Martha's conferred for the last three years, and then he finally gets his ult, and he comes second in an NPC, <laughs> which I'm just like, oh, that is just, that's just a sad, that is a huge sad for Marth, um, because he just doesn't get, ooh, tickets, okay, nice. Uh, like, Marth doesn't get exclusive skill. Um, Erica, I was really, was thinking she'd win. Um, I'm kind of sad she didn't win, and Marianne did. Um, because I was hoping that, uh, ooh, that's a good one. Okay, Shamir, Shannon. Do I F him again? Wasn't he in the last one? Wasn't Sam and Sophus in the last one? I mean, fair, fair. I'd probably just try get Shamir merges, maybe? I don't know, actually, because I'd have Shamir, I'd have, um, Sophus and, I don't think I've got, I'd have Sophus, um, still. And Shannon would be cool for Deadeye and Time Pulse Father. Um, see, so yeah, I was really hoping Erica would win, and so Marianne. Um, we've got six free houses characters now as Grand Hero, but, uh, as, um, Brave Alts. I was kind of hoping that it would be like Erica and Corin out of the realistic ones, or Hilda and I oh know Hilda's three houses, but like soft spot for Hilda. So like she just bypasses uh, any care about um, like you know too many braves from three houses. Um, but yeah, it's just I don't know. It's it's, I'm, it's just a shame. I'm kind of like yeah, big sad. Um, was was a bit sad that uh they did, they got that, but oh well. 
like you know whatever it's 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 not too much of a bother i'm kind of just like oh uh, but you know good job for marianne fans uh good job for gate people fans mar fans and eric fans obviously just kind of just kind of sad that marth and erica didn't get the exclusive skill and was kind of hoping gatekeeper would win next year but that's about it really uh, as long as they do something interesting with gatekeeper and they add gatekeeper in reg regularly um, as his own regular unit at some point, I'll be happy. Um, because last year they were really boring. It was like, you know, the same unit type for everyone. Like, we got Red Mage Lysithia, Lance Infantry, um, Dimitri, Bowflyer, Claude, and, um, I'm an Elder God. So yeah. Yeah, nice. Okay, good job. I'm happy this is happening again. Something special planned. Hey, the top four heroes in hey. the Golden Gauntlet will be featured in a summoning event. All right, I wonder who's everyone's What's picking for this. If you summon a total of four, because I'm trying to think who's like the most like event, OP unit people would want, you know? Um, I still think like Lif is an amazing choice because DC and uh, Time Pulse Father is just amazing. Um, so I still think that's, he's one of the best choices you could have. Oh, look at a cake. I want it as well. Where's Effie? She's gonna eat that. <laughs> Effie's gonna eat the cake. Nope. Effie's gonna eat it. Or Liana's gonna eat it. Or Rinka's gonna eat it. Someone's gonna come eat that cake. I'm sorry, but you ain't eating that, Faye. Wait, who's this? Is that two duo heroes? Or is that a weapon? It looks like some familiar faces from both Asker and Embla are here to see. Asker and Embla. Let's take a look together. Is it Veronica again? Because I just talked. I must protect my people. <laughs> what is with it? With them, I guess, like, always adding, like, some sort of dad unit for Valentine's Day, but not as an actual unit. Like, when are we going to get the rest of them? Like, I'm fine with Gustav as a Valentine's ult, but, like, is he? Okay, that's fine. That's fine, he's an infantry or an armor unit. Okay, I'm fine with that. I didn't want him to be like an axe armor and then we get him as a normal ult and then he's axe armor. Like, no, I didn't want him to be axe cavalry and then he's an axe cavalry again for his normal ult. So, like, I'm fine with axe infantry. Oh, Henry! Oh, that's cute! I'm glad we finally. I'm, I'm glad we finally got her in the game. Because she was voted quite high in the voting gauntlet. And. I kind of wish she got a regular ult first, but you know, that's still fine. That's still alright. Was she red mate, red term? She literally said she couldn't fight, and then this happens. Oh, she's holding back, damn. Oh, Alphonse! Oh. Look at Alphonse. What is he? Because he looks like a tome user this time. Wait, is it Bruno and um, uh, Veronica then, I guess? For the ne last unit? Was he an armored tome? I saw Bold Fight of him, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's. I'm pretty sure I just saw um, a Bold Fighter. Okay, yeah, there's Veronica. Okay. But yeah, I'm just sad we don't have regular Veronica in. Like, she's just got- she's, this is her fourth ult and no OG unit. Like, please, give us OG Veronica. <laughs> like, it just makes me sad, you know? Like, it's a sad. Wait, do we not have a duo unit? We don't have a du I don't like duo units, so that's fine. Nice! Wait. Yeah, we don't have one. Alright. Fair. Oh, the whisper of Anzander. <laughs> oh, <laughs> she's just stunning, Veronica. The day of devotion, a day to express gratitude to those important to you. What? The <laughs> this festival is not meant for us. Okay. We should go. I was not expecting them to get alts. Wow! Can you believe it? Last, but certainly Fair last. enough. We have Leaf and Thrasir. They were once powerful foes who opposed the Order of Heroes back in Book Three. But now, red, red, what is that sea skill? As a duo hero, Hello. They're also wearing brightly colored clothes for the Day of Devotion Festival. What is that sea skill? I want to know what that is. I was honestly not expecting those two to get 
want to know. Gustav, Henriette, Alphonse, so that's five characters. Oh, Veronica's. Ah, your poor Shirena. They really said fuck Shirena, huh? Also join your barracks if you earn enough points in the associated Tempest Trials. Hey, that's actually a big sad for them. Poor Shirena. Remember those tickets I mentioned? Well, you can also earn five first summon tickets for this summoning event. That's alright. I don't know who I'd go for to be honest. And it's definitely like a free, su a free summon only banner for me though, but it's cute. I'm glad I can, like, save for a bit. So bad for Sharina and Adam, man! When they get into the world! <laughs> poor them! Poor, poor them. Alright, so I know the characters we're getting. Ooh. Please demote some characters. I'm begging. I'm begging. Please. This bit's already quite nice. But please... Demote Hector. Demote all the for Gen One characters, please. Next up is Faye. Oh, guns. What are you doing here? Is something wrong? Faye, Faye. What's up? <gasps> oh, look at you. What? With the next version update, summoners will be able to customize themselves. Oh. You can set things up on this screen. Oh, I love it! The My Summoner menu. How do you do this? You set your name, your greeting when you visit a friend's castle, and more. I love it! Oh my god! You can change your summoner's appearance here. Oh, so have you got like face looks? Okay, that's cool. Even some accessories like It'd be cool if you could like... Summoners. To be sure to he's a unit! Oh, look at his playable! Oh, he's not a gun unit, he's a tome unit, but that's a shame. That's a shame. But like, ah, oh, I was really hoping we'd get a gun unit. Yeah, I really wish that was a gun. That's a shame. I felt like that was missed. Dire braid about. That's a brave weapon because dire thunder. Um, yeah, it's like a, it's kind of a sage. This isn't the Mjolnir strike you're familiar with. Oh yeah, this I'm looks different. I'm so glad you noticed. I don't have much more on that now, but not to worry. We'll explain. Can you only use something more Mjolnir strike then? Via an in-game notification. Fey? Oh, that's right. That summoner seemed to have some really powerful skills, didn't they? They did. How do you think they learned them? With their special copy Copies. skills power, of course. Copy Ooh. skills allows you to choose skills that your ally heroes have. Okay, that's cool. And equip them right to I really self. like that. Faye. So is that why it's called Diabrida a uh, Bilk? Is that just like really it, they to copy a tome? To okay, like I'm really happy with that. Um, it would be cool. Uh, I mean, we could mod that to make them look different. I might do that because that'd be really cool. Um, this just in. but, We're but, yeah, a new oh, type of changes, and more changes to how changes to summoning, please demote some, Let's go over some who watches the speed, I'll, I, I like the summoning, um, I, I like that, it's a shame I didn't add gun units, because I think with this world, and that weapon, would be the perfect time to uh, make gun units, because I really want gun units and gauntlet units. heroes that previously appeared in legendary hero summoning events, will now begin appearing in Legendary Hero Remix Summoning Events instead. Okay. These Legendary Heroes will be appearing in Legendary Hero Remixes from now on. Not only are they appearing in a new type of summoning event, but I hear some of them will be able to learn additional skills. Ooh. To start things off, Legendary Heroes Ike and Fjorm will be learning additional skills. Even better, they won't be so much love. any of their current skills in exchange hey. for these ones. They'll have the option to learn them in addition to the skills they already have. So, are they learning a new skill? Aether two and joint drive resistance. That okay. Means able to increase his and his allies' resistance, and it'll be easier for him to use his special as well. Damn. Fjorm will be getting ice mirror two and attack defense unity. Okay, that's good. She'll be able to reduce damage while dishing out even more steady damage than before. 
She'll be even stronger when oh, that's really good. I wish I just they, they didn't change the name though. joining Fjorm and Ike in this new summoning event, and the appearance rate for five star focus heroes will okay. be percent I might summon With that depending who's on there. For each summoning stone color, equaling a total of Ooh. eight heroes with an appearance rate of six percent. Okay, yeah, I might if Gunfra's on there, which I think she would be. I might because I really want to merge Gunfra. It looks like you'll be able to choose one hero to summon for free in this Gunfra, Gunfra. Okay, yep, yeah, I know what I'm saving orbs for. I mean, I've already got like 360, so I know what I'm saving orbs for. Yay! Legendary hero remix. They're the eleventh. Okay. I want to know who the other characters are. Next up, I'll cover Please demote some stuff. I swear, please. What's our special rate? Noni. What's this? Please be. Just please demote them. Please. I'm begging. I'm begging you. <laughs> please. What is this? I thought I'd summoned a four star hero, but they turned into a five star hero instead. I think I'm starting to understand how this works. I'm not. <laughs> I'm this so confused. On your four star special rate. Plus, when you summon a four star hero who becomes a five star hero on the screen, the five star hero appearance rate that you've built up with summons won't be reduced. Okay. The heroes that are available to be summoned is this unit devotion? Heroes that appeared in the game up until August of 2018 show. Oh, oh my God! Them in summoning event revivals, huh? From now on, these heroes will no longer appear in summoning events at five star rarity. The four star special rate will be available on summoning events. Oh at yes! After Thank you. Oh my God! Hey. I can stop merging stuff finally. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I'm very happy about that. Wait, can you get them in legendary remixes and stuff then? I'm so confused. That's all I have the energy for today. Oh, thank god. Very happy. I just want to take this opportunity. That is a big hat. It's due to your support that the Fire Emblem Heroes game has made it all the way to its fourth anniversary. Oh, I'll hi. I'll doing what I can to make sure things stay fresh, exciting, and I'm surprised fun. no one ate that cake. And I humbly request your continued oh, Phoenix is on there. as we enter the game's fifth year. Or Felix. Year. Is it Felix? Oh, I can't remember. Alice or Phoenix. Scott. Phoenix or Felix. We received some fantastic illustrations to commemorate... Oh, that's what the last few minutes are. Okay. Some of the I was just like, is there anything else? Fire Emblem Heroes. Be sure to stick around to check them out. Now, all right. I guess I could just talk uh, over the art then. Um, I think this is really good. Uh, overall, obviously I'm a little sad over the brave picks, but what can you do? Uh, there's always next year. Um, still hoping for Veronica and regular Gatekeeper, um, and a few other characters who've only received just like, you know, special alts instead of regular appearances uh, to get alts at some point, or to get their original appearance at some point. Um, the unit customization feature is fucking cool as shit. Um, really hoping we can mod that in some way. I think we should be able to. Um, so I'm excited for that. Um, my only sort of. Uh, my only wish for this direct that we didn't get was uh, a new weapon type, so I'm really hoping we had those at some point. Um, it's been a long while since we've had- last one we got was a colorless- uh, colorless tomes. Um, but we haven't had a new proper type since beast units, uh, which is like two years ago now. Um, and I think it was a missed opportunity to- for- to make the summoner, uh, a gun unit, if we ever got guns. Um, because I know they're not in regular Fire Emblem, but it would be interesting, I think. Um, and I, I don't know, it's just a shame it's a, it's a tome, not a, oh my god, they look amazing, holy shit, I hope that's an ult at some point, because that's amazing, what the fuck? <laughs> um, oh my god, Freya! Yeah, so like, I just, yeah, I kind of wish we had a gun unit instead, um, of a, um, a colorless tome, but other than that, it's really cool. 
Uh, definitely going to see about how we can mod that uh, so I can change my summoner a bit. It would be really nice. And yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video, my dudes. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.